Hey everyone, I just wanted to make a video going over what you should do when you uh, you have your drive and you've got this uh, OT1 uh, flashing on the screen. So OT1, it's uh, over torque detection. I'm gonna go through how to uh, basically get into the parameters and kind of do an explanation for what the parameters mean. So if you get a drive, it's got OT1 on it. I'm going to try to go to the parameters that are responsible for OT1. Uh, it show, they're showing zeros, so maybe there's a password set. So I did another video on passwords you can check out, but I go to 0, 0 0.08. Yep, it's set to 1, so there's a password there. So I need to go to 0, 0 0.07 and input my password. Uh, before starting the video, I configured a password to be four ones. So I enter that, zero, zero, point zero, 0.08 is zero, so the drive is unlocked. And now I can go into my over torque settings and I can see how they've been configured in the drive. Uh, so that's kind of how to get into them and get into the drive and unlock it. And then I'm going to throw up a PowerPoint and go over what the different settings mean. Okay, so now I'm just going to go into a little bit more detail about the over torque detection uh, parameters. Uh, so 0606, this is your over torque detection uh, selection, or it's the behavior that the drive is going to do if an over torque is detected. Uh, so options uh, one and three both say continue operation. Uh, that means if over torque is detected, it's going to show a warning. So it's going to show the OT1 on the keypad, but the drive is going to keep running. Uh, options two and four are both stop. So stop means the drive is going to actually have a fault. It's going to show the same OT1 on the display on the keypad, but the drive is going to stop and will need to be uh, reset, like so using the, the reset button on the keypad uh, in order to run again. Uh, one other distinction, uh, options one and two are only at constant speed operation, whereas options three and four are during run. So that's going to, run is going to include monitoring your amps during ramp up, ramp down, and constant speed operation. Uh, the other parameters uh, for over torque detection, uh, 0607 is your over torque, over torque detection level. So it's a percentage. Uh, the default is 120%. Uh, where 100% corresponds to the rated current of the drive. So if you're using, for example, this MS300 model, uh, this number I've got highlighted in red is your uh, rated current of the drive. So for this model, 100% would be 11 amps, 120% uh, would be 13.2 amps. Uh, and I've got another example down here, just how to set your over torque detection level if you've got a VFD that's a little oversized uh, for the motor that you're using. So you can check out how to do that, pretty straightforward. Um, and then the last parameter here is your 0608, which is your over torque detection time. And that just says, you know, you're, you're defining the time that you can be at or above your over torque detection, detection level uh, before you're going to trip or fault or warn, uh, do whatever your action is in parameter 0606. Uh, and then if you, one other thing to mention, if you want to monitor your output amps on the drive, you just press the mode button a few times and you'll have a display that'll show your output amps uh, just for reference. Um, if you have any questions or if there's any topics you'd like a video about, uh, please leave a comment below. Uh, thanks for watching.